some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, uh, we find ourselves in Kissimmee, Florida, where Ass Elmo is invading the city hall, trying to get answers for some slight that happened to him. But he gets completely ignored. Oh, poor little guy. Maybe you should go home and have your mama tuck you into bed so you can cry into your pillow. As for the rest of us, we can all sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Alright guys, so we're at the mayor's office over here in Kissimmee, Florida. Where? How you doing? Hi. What, what's your position here? Records specialist. Records. Okay. Do you know when, when the city manager is going to arrive? I don't. No problem. Have a good day. This lady um, feels like we could get kicked out of here. There's nobody to help us. No one to complain. Oh, poor little guy getting ignored. I mean, it must suck. But you know what? Let me regale you with the uh, story of the uh, boy who cried wolf. You see, a long time ago, there was a boy... Well, we all know that damn story. I'm not going to sit here and tell it. But uh, anyway, you're the boy who cried wolf. And guess what? The town of Kissimmee is on to you. And, well, they're starting to ignore you. So let me ask you something. How does it feel to get ignored? I'm shitting my pants right now, but hey. Too much information, Asselmo. That's not exactly what I asked you. So let's go ahead and carry on, okay? So, if you guys saw our earlier video and you guys are disgusted and feel that, you know, everybody here needs to be retrained, you can call the city of Kissimmee to, okay, city manager, or the city manager here. Now, it is the sign of a truly butthurt frauder when they start uh, posting the information of every employee in the building. So they can get call flooded and uh, crash the uh, phone system within their departments. And you know what? Uh, not a great tactic to begin with. Because you could be temporarily bringing down vital phone systems such as the nine, local 911 system. And guess what? If somebody dies because of that, well, that's on the head of the frauder. But hey, they're always saying feelings don't matter. And if somebody dies and a lot of people start grieving because of uh, the death of that person because of something they caused. Well, who cares? That's their feelings, not mine. We're in Kissimmee. Tax dollars are a joke over here. They they just you know they just spend money and don't really care about the service. Some people are nice, others are rude. Maria feels like she's the bomb, but she's you know what I'm saying. She's not. She's nice, but she's not nice at the same time. So she feels like we can. Uh, get ignored and our concerns are not important so it's not our concerns it's your concerns your concerns are trying to remain relevant i mean your frauding career has been on borrowed time for quite a while your viewership is down quite a bit you're not making as many videos and uh, you're as a result you're not traveling as much let's face it ass elmo uh, your arguments are piss poor at best, so they are easy to debunk, and you don't have the intelligence to come up with some uh, ironclad arguments on your behalf. So, you're a dying breed, dude. So just deal with it. Hi. Yes. What's your, what's your position here? Okay. Um... I have a situation where I really need to speak to somebody. When I, um, I'm a citizen journalist, and I came here checking up on the service, 
and an employee from here, from, from the Senator Torres office on the third floor, um, I just casually asked him, hey, how are you? You know, why, uh, how long you've worked here or whatever? Extremely nice. And he just started cussing and, and giving me the middle finger. And are you sure it wasn't something that you did or said to antagonize the situation? Because that's what you're good at. You're good at talking, and that's really about it. Talking and annoying people. So undoubtedly, you must have said something to him that uh, pissed him off at that point. So come on, tell us the truth. Was it you that caused him to be pissed off, or was he never pissed off to begin with, and it was you who was pissed off because, well, you tend to get butt hurt very easily. Being extremely nasty to me. So Yeah, they, they, they have an office in this building. But he's an employee of the state. Okay, so you want to file a complaint or you want to talk to Well, no, I don't really need to file a complaint. The thousands of, of people, this happened only an hour ago, okay. and thousands of people have already seen it. Okay. So, and, and I, I'm from Kissimmee. Yeah. The last thing I want is to give uh, a make, post a video on the internet that's gonna give a uh, bad image to the to the place I love. Oh my God! Who the hell cares? For that, you gotta consider the source, and seeing as how you're the source of that, I really don't think anybody would care too much what you would have to say. Okay, so is there? I mean, who are you willing to speak with? I mean, is there someone in the senator's office you'd like to make a call so you can speak with them? I. I, I tried, but there's nobody there. And then I come here. And then the, the city manager's not in. The, the, the mayor's not in. Every time we come here, we can never get a hold of the mayor or the city manager. It's like, and there's nobody here asking for them. So. Well, now, uh, I'm just going to end the video right here, considering that the rest of it is just her talking about what options he actually has to be able to file a complaint and well uh that's all up to him after that but seriously ass elmo uh you are a dying breed your uh channel is truly dying you may have a hundred million views but that happens to every channel at some point where it eventually collapses and falls apart and that's exactly what is happening to your channel right now you're trying to uh, maintain some sense of relevance but uh you have not been able to uh modify your arguments and um somehow make them better right uh you you present the same old tired arguments over and over again and you just don't have the brains to correctly modify them or uh, even create new ones. And hey, I guess that's your fault for not uh, paying attention in, in school. So, well, whatever. That's not my issue. That's your issue. At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.